people of God. So I just want to show you that the mark of the beast has been here for a long time. People already have the mark of the beast. It's just now it's being forced. Now, Revelations 13 and 6, and he calls all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Where do we see people with marks in their foreheads? Rich people, celebrities. And Leviticus 19 and 28, you shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord. Remember, the mark in your forehead. People already worship Satan openly. And people have eyes to see that. And they see not. And they have ears to hear that people worship Satan. And they hear not. They have eyes to see and they see not. Mark in your forehead. We know Christ was slewed on a tree, not on a cross. What does the cross represent? Well, you should look that up. They have these new tattoos on the forehead. Anything means faith. Anything means faith? Anything means faith? Does that sound like something from God to you? Try the Spirit's love. Does these look like spirits that be of God? Does these fear God? Is this the fear of God with a cross in their forehead? Now keep going. Anything means faith. Anything really means faith, people? People already have the mark of the beast. Oh, he has the pyramid and the evil eye in the middle of his forehead. Is this a representing of the Holy Father? Oh, another one. A mark in their forehead. And they do it as a style. And you don't know that they have the mark of the beast already. They don't need the jab. Oh, is this not a... a the mark of the beast no I guess you don't know because you have eyes to see and you see not oh this is not another mark of the beast in your forehead oh wow really some people worship Satan openly openly Revelations 13 and 16 and he caused all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand and on their foreheads. People to go up higher levels with money. Just do those things willfully. You know, you hear all the time people sell their soul to Satan. To receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Well, hey, you have eyes to see, right? And the great dragon, which was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceived the whole world. How did he deceive the whole world? He puts it in your face and you still don't see it. And you still don't understand it. Because you believe everybody's good, right? Well, God made good and he made evil. So he made good people and he made evil people. He made good creation and there's evil creation. Now, the old serpent called the devil Satan, which deceived the whole world. Oh, yes, he did. Oh, yes, he did. He was cast out into the earth and his angels were cast out with him. You shall not make any cuttings in your flesh or the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord. I guess that's not the mark of the beast either, right? I guess not. I guess not. 1 John 4 and 1. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. Son of man, thou dwells in the midst of a rebellious house, which have eyes to see and see not. They have ears to hear and hear not, for they are a rebellious house. 2 Thessalonians 2 and 11. And for this cause, God, call, God shall send them strong dissolutions that they should believe a lie. What is a dissolution? An idiosyncratic belief or impression that is firmly maintained despite being contradicted by what is generally accepted as reality or rational argument, typically a symptom of mental disorder. Is this not mental disorder where you have eyes to see 
and you see not. You have ears to hear and you hear not when it's being pushed in your face. God gave you, what did he say? He'll give you a strong dissolution that you should believe a lie. What are other similarities for a dissolution? Misapprehensions, mistaken impression, false impression, mistaken belief, misconception, misunderstanding, mistake, error, misinterpretation. Remember, you can be walking in the spirit of truth or the spirit of error. You're not walking in the spirit of truth. You're walking in the spirit of error. Misinterpretation, misconstruction, misbelief, fallacy, illusion, figment of the imagination, fantasy, chimera, fool's paradise, self-deception, the action of deluding or the state of being deluded, deception, misleading, deluding, fooling, tricking, trickery, trickery, duping. So this, you've been duped by the devil to not see the mark of the beast and know that you already have it. 